guys welcome back to my channel so for this video I'm going to be using the new Mish Beauty products that I received and I'm going to be telling you guys is it good for color treated hair because I already did a video on when my hair was not color treated and the products work perfectly fine so now I got to do an updated one when my hair is colored bleached so yeah before we get started don't forget to subscribe like and turn on the bell so you're gonna find whenever I post. So, just like my last video, I'm gonna do a voiceover. So, I'm not even gonna do that much talking in the beginning. I'm just gonna go right over to me in the shower and use all my products so you guys can get the review right away. No wasting time. Let's go! I'm starting off with the Detox Mesh Beauty Shampoo. I'm just gonna use the applicator and put it all over my scalp. So, as you guys can see, it's really lathering in my hair, and I feel like it really cleansed my hair without stripping it. It even kind of moisturized my hair at the same time, but I literally love the lather, and my hair was definitely clean afterwards. While taking out the shampoo, I got some in my eye, so I completely forgot to record the product that I was using, so I'm going to include a picture. So this is a deep conditioner. It actually had more slip than I expected, considering it's a deep conditioner and not a conditioner. It was very thick, and you can see with the strands of my hair that my hair was super moisturizing after using it, and it had a lot of slip. I left this in my hair for about 30 minutes. Next is the leave-in and the curl defining cream. So I felt like the leave-in was a good consistency, it wasn't too thick or too thin, and it definitely moisturized my hair, which is what a leave-in is supposed to do. For the curl defining cream, it was definitely thicker than the leave-in, and it definitely clumped my curls together more than the leave-in did. Now onto the curl defining gel, which is something I've never used before. So I'm using my regular praying hands method, and as you can see, towards the front of my face, my curls are definitely clumping together and are super hydrated. Now I'm just combing my hair through in an upward motion so that I get out all the knots, the product is evenly distributed, and so that I can get a voluminous look at the end, that is why I'm doing it upwards. Alright guys, my hair is dry. Right now it looks really good. So we'll see after I fluff it out. Don't mind that I have a whole robe on, it's literally breezing. Um, the Mish Beauty uh, Polished Hair and Scalp Oil. Y'all already know how I feel about this because I use it in every single video. So we know how I felt about this one already. So let's just shake it out. Alrighty, these are my results. I literally love them. I might even love them more than my results that I had the first time when I didn't have color in my hair. So, yeah, I literally love my results. My curls are defined. It's a little frizzy back here just because it wasn't completely dry, but I'm super tired and I want to go to bed. So, I still fluffed it out. Obviously, the whole front, you can see, the front was completely dry and it looks great. See, this is like the only part. It was a little bit damp. And that's why it looks like that. But like I said, besides that, it looks great. And I did like a volume thing to get more volume in the shower. And it helped because I have a lot more volume. And it's like even. So I love my results. I love the products. And my hair just looks and feels amazing. Okay, okay. Um, If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe. Like. And turn on the bell so you get notified whenever I post.